Hi, my name is Gong Jun and I'm from Mayflower Secondary School. I have always struggled with English as a subject because of how my teachers taught me English. So, um, for example, when we are doing comprehension passages, they would, she would usually uh, give us a lot, of, a lot of exam papers and she would expect us to finish them all at one go and then she would just go through it during class and, uh, give, and give, us an, uh, give us the model answers. Therefore, uh, I, never, I never really did learn anything and she never really uh, gave any sort of method to answer this sort of questions. When, when our teacher gives us the model answers, we are expected to copy it down on our exam paper and uh, through this, she expects us to improve on our comprehension. And I felt that this wasn't, this, uh, this didn't help at all. However, in EduH, uh, Mr. Cheng and Miss Yu has taught me the close reading, close reading technique. Even though this method took more time than just reading through the text, I still applied it during O-levels and it has actually helped me a lot in answering all of the language use questions that pose as a threat to many, many students. And uh, during prelims, uh, during our final prelims, my mum was actually quite worried because uh, she was not seeing any improvement despite me being in the program for so many years. And she actually urged me to try another English program. However, uh, I believed in what Mr. Cheng said. I believe in the structures that they've taught me and I can see that how, they, how those structures and methods have helped, can help me in answering the, the tough English questions and to tackle the paper more effectively. So therefore, I trusted, in, I trusted the EduH techniques and uh, I, did not, I did not listen to my mom and I continued on with the program. And uh, during my O-levels, I actually made a three grade improvement to a B3. EduAges techniques are very useful and they will help you in answering, tackling your O-level paper. To enter all EduH students who are struggling with their English grades, uh, do not fret. Remember to always apply the techniques and always practice and practice. Like what Mr. Cheng said before, a, swimmer, a great swimmer doesn't learn how to swim by observing other people swim. Make sure that you are applying the techniques and practicing every single day if you want to see an improvement.